everyone, welcome to a, another new video. Today I'm doing something that I have never done before. I'm gonna be putting bubbles on nails. This video is not sponsored by bubbles or by any polishes that you see. So here we go, I'm going in with the first coat. You, we're gonna put this on really, really, really thin. Um, only because we're gonna be putting on quite a thick layer. Um, I think, kind of testing. Wasn't sure what I was doing at this point. Go ahead and cure. I'm going into the second layer, but keep it really, really thin. Super thin. Okay, so that's the second coat done. I'll pop that in the lamp to cure again. Okay, so now we're gonna go in with a much thicker coat and we're not gonna cure it this time. Okay, so we're not gonna cure it. We're gonna leave it there, we're not gonna touch it. Just leave it alone. We're gonna grab some water, ta-da. And um, you, I'm just using hand soap, non-sponsored, not sponsored by any soap products. <laughs> and just squirt that in the water and mix it, mix it, mix it up until it froths up and we've got some bubbles. Now, I wasn't really sure how to get the bubbles onto the nails. I ended up just using a fan brush. Um, I'm sure you could find something to use. I don't know what <laughs> off the top of my head. But yeah, I just used this fan brush and just lightly scooped up the bubbles, no water, just the bubbles, and then flip it and pop it lightly onto the nail. <laughs> You're just gonna wanna cover the whole nail in bubbles. Okay, so we're gonna see how this turns out. Go ahead and cure that. And let's see. I wasn't sure what I was doing. I was kind of nervous at this point. We did it. We've got bubbles, we've got bubbles on the nail. Okay, you see that? I'm trying to focus. Oh, it looks like craters, it looks like the moon. Oh my God, the ideas are just running through my head at this point. Okay, so I top coated it and it's okay. Like, you know, yeah, it kind of gets rid of the, you know, but it's okay. So I'm going in with a white from the Beatles range and this pink. This pink is like perfect bubblegum pink. It is so like, it's pink, pink. <laughs> you will see in a minute. Okay, so I try to do like an ombre on this nail. So I'm going in with a really thin coat of white. And then I cured that. And then I went in with this pink, as you can see, oh, it's really, it's like Barbie bubblegum pink. It's bright. Okay, now I'm going to go in with this tiny sponge and then you just dab, dab, dab the nail in the middle to kind of just blend it in with that white. I put a teeny, teeny, tiny bit of white on the sponge as well on the top. You'll see me switch onto that in a minute. Oh, I've got fluff on the nail. Okay, um, but yeah, just keep dabbing. There, there I am going in with a bit of white and just keep blending and cure that. So here's the issue that I had. Um, it has to be kind of a thick layer. I was like, oh no, it needs to be a really thick layer for the bubbles to kind of like, to really show up, like to massively show up. So I was like trying to blend this without like reducing the amount of gel polish that was on the nail. So that was a bit of a, a difficult thing. I'm sure it can be done. I was like thinking maybe I should create the bubbles in a top coat. I don't know, I don't know. Maybe I should have tested that as well. But as I said, ideas were running through my head. <laughs> We've got our bubbles again. Here we go, I'm gonna scoop them up. Place them onto the nail.
Like I really wanted to do like a space theme or something like that. I don't know. I go ahead and cure that. Okay, so we're going to wipe it off and we're going to see. And there you have it. It's kind of bald in the midriff. Like, yeah. Bubbling on top, bubbling at the bottom, but in the middle, she's kind of lacking. <laughs> okay, so this is what I was really excited for. I've seen it going around on Instagram, like those milkshake, the strawberry milkshake nails with the, the, the frothy, like foamy top. Um, so that's what we're doing. So I'm going in with a light base of pink. Again, all these polishes that I'm using are from the Beatles gel. Um, and you can go and look in my bio, uh, sorry, not in my bio, in my description down below. And there's a link down there. Click on that and you get 15% off your first order. So now I'm going into this red and I'm just going to pop it on the palette next to me, just there. And yeah, we're going to start off um, by doing some strawberries. So I'm just kind of getting the colours ready to do that. You can get like these um, Fimo or Fimo um, cutouts of strawberries. Uh, I've seen those about. Um, but yeah, we're going to go freehand and do some strawberries. <laughs> Okay, so we're ready. I'm just going to mix some red and the white together because I didn't want to go straight in and be like, bang, red strawberry. <laughs> like, we're going to build her up. We're going to, you know, you know, ease her into it. So we're just going to be a little soft strawberry to begin with. I'm just doing kind of like a, a very small cone-like shape. Skinny at the bottom. And, then, and then here we go. Now we've got, you can see what I'm doing now. <laughs> okay, we're going to add some lighter in the middle and just get in, you know, that stalky bit. <laughs> in the middle does not look like a strawberry right now like at all you just kind of have to like you know imagine imagine it's a strawberry <laughs> okay so we're gonna get some more white i'll we'll plop it there and I'm getting some of their top coat. And the camera is really like glowing right there. Oh, there you go. <laughs> it's better. Right, okay, so now we're gonna like mix the top coat and the white together to kind of like make this creamy like wash just to go over it for like the milkshake. So it's going to be in layers, this is good, it's, yeah, we're going to layer it up to be a milkshake, like a frozen milkshake, like, or something like, I don't know, <laughs> some sort of pink drink. Go ahead and cure that layer, and now we're going to go in and do another strawberry. I kind of left the strawberries kind of from halfway down to the bottom, um, I, sh ugh, I was kind of thinking about putting one near the top, but I was like, I don't know, would it float? <laughs> it's like one of those, like, will it float tests? Do strawberries, strawberries float, don't they? Yeah, yeah, they do. <laughs> I was like, when doing these, I was like, does it make sense for them to be at the top of the drink also? Like... I don't know. Oh, well. I 
Okay, so we're adding some more red. Now I kind of want to test if strawberries actually do float. Should have Googled it. Leave it in the comments. Do strawberries float? Yes or no? <laughs> Learning things today. So I decided to add some bits into it. Instead of adding another strawberry, we've got some strawberry bits. Some um, floaty bits. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and cure that. And we're going to go back to our white and gel wash. And yeah, do some more creamy swillage. Swillage? That sounds gross. <laughs> so yeah, we're, we're doing that bit again. And once you're happy with it, go ahead and cure it. You can use as little or as much as you like. I'm going to add some to the top as well of the nail because um, we're going to be putting white up there anyway. And I don't really want to, you know, you kind of need it to have, you know, quite a few coats. So decided to just do a quick whiz over the top just to kind of hide the pink a little bit more. And now I'm curing it. Nope. Now, now she's curing. She's curing. Okay. <laughs> okay, so back in with the white. We're going to do the frothy bit now. Ooh. So remember, a thick coat and don't cure it until you've got your bubbles on. <laughs> I've done some like drippy, like spill over the side of the glass. Remember to try and keep it as thick as possible, it, like depending on how bubbly you want it to be. That's kind of, I guess, what you do. Okay, get my bubbles. Oh, I got white on my finger there. That's how thick it is. <laughs> okay, now we're curing. And there it is. We've got a frothy strawberry milkshake. <laughs> you can go ahead and just kind of buff down if it's like a little bit, you know, spiky. Um, just to get a little bit off the top. Um, it's a bit jaggedy. And that will need a lot of top coat to kind of like, you know. Or you can keep it jaggedy, but it will be catching on everything. Like literally, it will snag your tights. So <laughs> here we are top coating the drink. Making it a shiny glass. A little bit there too. <laughs> okay. So there it is bubble gel nails thank you so much for watching i had so much fun making this video and testing it out and being very scientific um don't forget to subscribe don't forget the link is down in the description so that you can grab some beetles nail gel and i'll see you on the next video thank you so much for watching bye bye